Holy and blessed Jesus Christ, the perfect radiance of the eternal Heavenly Father, who enlightens us with joy. As dusk draws in upon us and the evening lights appear, we sing our praise-filled hymns to God, the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Son of God, you deserve that every age joyfully sing your praise, for you give life and so all the world gives to you its glory. Yet as we come to the end of this day, we acknowledge our need of forgiveness. And so together we say, most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another, that we have sinned in thought, word and deed and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. With the confidence that our requests are answered, we say, Calm me, O Lord, as you stilled the storm. Still me, O Lord, keep me from harm, let all the tumult within me cease. Enfold us, Lord, within your peace. Before we sleep, we long to hear from God in his word, and tonight we listen to Psalm 50, verse 15, which says, Cry out to me in your adversity, for I will deliver you, and you will glorify me. We know a lot about adversity and many of us can testify to the fact that the Lord has brought us through our troubles and delivered us. But this verse adds a precious truth. The experience of the believer in and through trials glorifies the Lord himself. What more? can we hope for and be assured of. O Lord our God, when assailed by the storms of life, hear our cry. Keep us and deliver us and, above all, be glorified through us. I will lie down this night with God, and God will lie down with me. I will lie down this night with Christ, and Christ will lie down with me. I will lie down this night with the Spirit, and the Spirit will lie down with me. God and Christ and the Spirit be lying down with me. Thus may the peace of all peace be ours tonight and every night, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.